Welcome to Deep Friday, where we're deep frying hand pie. Ooh. Deep fried hand pie. So we have tried some of these Wiki Kitchen hand pies on uh, uh, Micro Delights, and they're pretty, pretty, pretty okay. And I think what would make them even better if I didn't have hair on my face, <laughs> and if they were deep fried. So we went ahead and picked a flavor I haven't had before. Um, because I wanted it to be something a little bit new. Uh, it's the spinach artichoke. Oh my god, that sounds amazing! Uh, I think that could be pretty good deep fried. So, here's the thing. Here's the key to deep frying frozen food items. Um, cook them as normal first. <laughs> Let them cool down. And then batter and deep fry them. High dive! Oh, oh yes, yeah, spaloosh. Now, okay, now, saying this thing that you did about hand pies, can uh -huh. you, like, say that about Hot Pockets? Uh, yes. Did we do yeah, the same thing with Hot Pockets? We, we have, nice. we've tried to cook a Hot Pocket. We made the mistake of trying to cook it from frozen. If I was ever to put a value to something, do you ever think I would say, hey, there's too little paprika in this? Yeah, I would. Uh, no. Yes, you would. I, I would like, never say that. Yes, you I would. Like I would never say that. Always, always too little paprika. I think people are too yeah. lenient on their paprika. Use. You're too soft. Put some more paprika in the goddamn fucking batter. Deep fried hand pie coming at ya. Here's your hand pie, honey. <laughs> yeah, yeah, go. <laughs> And I'm gonna take the middle because that's the best part. Oh my god, really? Yeah. Oh, look at that. Get a nice thumbnail shot of that. That's money. Okay. okay. Ah. Oh. Oh my god. Mmm. The filling in this thing's amazing. Oh, it's delicious. The um, the spinach or whatever is in there, the leafy greens, little thick. A little chewy, but the flavor of those things, fantastic, wonderful. <laughs> the floor thinks mm. it's wonderful too. Yeah, There's a lot, of, a lot down there. And the the flaky pastry against the batter does super well. Oh my god, the salt levels are great. The flavor is great. <laughs> Mog even, is great. Even Mog knows, and she's not even here. <laughs> Oh my god. Mm -hmm. I don't remember I, when we did these. As much as it was fantastic make fun of hand pie. I think we're a pretty good product though. Yeah. I like this is not bad at all. I actually were saying like there's like you can kind of tell where you get like the weird spinach piece mm -hmm. in there. Like I still think like this could use something like just to dip it into, and I think like the hand pies themselves, you could use like a sauce, but I could see that maybe a little bit of ranch or something. Yeah, like something just to moisten it up a little bit more. Yeah. But the, like the overall flavor is really good. I don't know if I can go with a star, but this is definitely a check plus. Like this is a tasty product, and I can see deep frying this more than just for the show. <laughs> like that just happened. I don't know. I know how that happened. That's not even close to my friend. <laughs> but it happened, and now spinach and artichoke. All right. That looks amazing. Can I say that? Yeah. That looks really nice. Yeah. All right. Well, you got a crispy bit. That makes me happy mm. in a lot of ways. Mm -hmm. I like this one a lot. It's combining all the best parts of a quiche with the best parts of a pastry. And um, I think once, once those two things come together, it does something pretty magical. It doesn't need the egg as a binder or a protein because the chicken's there. And it has a nice amount of sauce to go with it, but a, a little bit more could be pretty nice, like where I was saying. Yeah. Um, I think a little bit more Alfredo or something would be uh, nice to carry this along. Maybe even Dare I say it, some marinara. 
Because Ooh, this would... I don't know. You don't think so? I, well, when I think of spinach and artichoke together, it's always mm -hmm. a dip. It's always a very cheesy, cheesy, creamy dip. Mm -hmm. You know what I think this needs? What's that? A little bit of crab meat. Oh, you're gonna you're gonna come to me and say you need crab meat? Because I will always say yes. <laughs> right. Everything needs crab meat. Air needs crab meat. Water needs crab meat. Everything. When I go take a number two, that needs crab meat. <laughs> God damn, everything needs crab meat, but it's too expensive. What is missing is the protein. There is no chicken in there. Yeah, that's true. It needs some protein. Does is, it? This is an entirely vegetarian. Yeah. Hand pie. It needs some pros. But it's still fucking delicious, mm -hmm. is the thing. Yeah. I taste cheese. I taste sauce. I, take, I taste a lot of nice texture. I was not wanting for meat. I really wasn't. But this is definitely a check plus. And I would say that if you were to get this weird product, this weird vegan product, yeah, warm up the deep fryer. Slap some batter on there. Throw it in. You never know what's going to happen. Come on. The, the world is a big place, and uh, we are just on a ball traveling 64,000 miles throughout the universe. How do you know what this shit's going to taste like when you deep fry it? Find out right now, because you never get another chance to live. You little bitches, go for it. Seize the day.